Tiago. I have the time, if I have the time to chant 64 rounds, should I prioritize that to reading or other other devo devotional activities? If you have the time, do it. You know, if, if you're in a situation where you can spare eight hours to ten hours a day just to chant, do it. You know, if you can do it. Now, if you've never done this before, you might be surprised how difficult it is. But uh, if you have the opportunity and the time, at least give it a try. Uh, you'll be amazed at the results if you can actually pull it off. But my suggestion would be to approach it gradually. Don't just go from 16 rounds one day to 64 rounds the next day. You won't be able to maintain it. You have to work up, up, up gradually. It's like athletics, you know. You don't start off uh, running uh, 10 miles a day. You gradually build up to it. So uh, the same is true of chanting. Yeah? He adds, uh, if I have, uh, what's the meaning of 64 rounds? If I take 10 hours but can only chant 50, wouldn't it be as good or something? Well, 64 rounds is uh, 100,000 holy names. If we're talking about the Hare Krishna Maha Mantra. 64 rounds is, is called a lakh, L-A-K-H, a lakh. Uh, that means 100,000 holy names, approximately. If you do the math, 64 times 108 times 16. Uh, so uh, uh, a person who chants that many rounds is called a lakh pati. Uh, means uh, someone who who has who does a hundred thousand names a day. So this is very nice if you can do this, and especially if you can maintain it for some time, you know, three to six months or so, you will get some just spectacular spiritual advancement. You know, I always tell everyone that that will hold still long enough to listen <laughs> that at some time in their life. You should just retire. And before you get old, uh, before you get much over 50 years of age, you should take six months to a year and just do nothing but chant. No matter what's going on in your life or what's going on in the world, just retire for a while. Go to a lonely place. Just with the basics, live the most simple, austere lifestyle you possibly can. And just chant. Chant, 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 chant. Most people say, I can't, 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 can't. <laughs> but if you are uh, really serious about attaining complete self-realization, full enlightenment, then you owe yourself to try this process, which means constant chanting. There's a very nice verse in Srimad Bhagavatam, first canto, fifth chapter, I think it's verse 15 or something which is that constant chanting of the holy name after the ways of the authorities is the most certain method of achieving complete self-realization. And what does that mean, after the ways of the authorities? That means you follow the example of the great souls, the acharyas, the spiritual masters, and the line. Uh, Tio. He's saying that if we can resend the document, he didn't receive it. What document? The, the one you sent us. Oh, I didn't send it out to everybody. I'm, I'm prevented from doing that by copyright agreements and stuff like that. But what we're going to do is analyze it. We're going to come up with a program that anybody can perform anywhere in the world that will enable them, or at least help them, to cope with the changes that are coming. And that's the least we can do, at least for our students. But uh, it's going to take us a few days of discussion. We just got the information today. So it's going to take us a while to come up with that. Question from Ronald Singh. Uh -huh. Stephen Knapp, was he a disciple of Swami Prabhupada? Yes. I was reading the story, the history of the line of masters from Stephen Knapp website. Mm. 
Yeah, so, that's, that's good. He, he's pretty good. I mean, he's a pretty level-headed guy. He, he sometimes gets a little bit uh, Hindu schmindu and, and, and gets a little political and, and like that. But his, um, his uh, compilations of biographical information about the Acharyas in our line is pretty accurate. It's pretty complete. Uh, he's written a couple of good books on the subject. So, uh, yeah, I'd recommend that. You could, why don't you post the link huh, so everybody can read it? That's it here. Okay. That's it? Okay. Good. Lion time. Thank you. 